Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name's Nikki and I love learning languages. One of the languages I'm learning is French, so I'm making this video to show you guys some of the YouTubers I watch or used to watch to learn French. Some of these channels are specifically made for learning French, but most of them are just channels run by French-speaking people, so there's something for you no matter what your level is. I spend way too much time on YouTube and this list is fairly long, but of course I need to preface this by saying that obviously this will not be an exhaustive list of French-speaking YouTubers, it's influenced heavily by my personal tastes, and it's just a collation of all the channels that I personally watch or have watched in the past. There are plenty more out there, so feel free to comment down below your favourite YouTubers that I don't mention to help me and others. I'll put a list of all the YouTubers in the comment section. I have a lot of YouTube channels to get through, so I won't be going too in-depth about any of them. So, let's get started. I'm going to start with YouTube channels specifically for learning French. Again, these are just the ones that I've watched, so if you know any others, comment down below. So first we have Français Authentique. This channel is intended for people who already have some sort of base in French, so it's not ideal for complete beginners. All of his videos are in French, but he speaks clearly. Next up is Piece of French. This channel is run by a French woman called Elsa. She makes videos about French slang and expressions, which are helpful for sounding more native. She also makes vlogs and speaks slowly and clearly. French Pod 101 is geared towards beginners and has a lot of videos on basic words and phrases. They also have more general videos on how to learn French. Easy French mainly does interviews with people in French-speaking countries, asking them questions about French and foreign culture. French Mornings with Elisa has a lot of videos on French slang and phrases to sound more natural in conversations. French with Alexa makes videos more geared towards beginners and low-intermediate learners. She has great videos on vocabulary and verb conjugations. French Comprehensible Input makes videos in French about a variety of topics, and they're categorised in terms of the CFR level from A1 to C2. The channel Learn French from Beginners to Advance has not uploaded in a while, but has a large backlog of informative videos you can watch. French Truly TV has lots of useful videos on pronunciation and listening skills. Now we move on to the native content. I've separated them into categories for clarity. First I wanted to mention French channels centred around language learning. There's Fluent Language Learning, who makes videos about different resources and techniques. Lauriane, Marathon des Langues, makes language learning videos about a wide range of languages. Le Monde des Langues also talks generally about language learning and gives tips to improve your learning in various ways. Next we have comedy slash entertainment channels. The first of these will probably be known to all of you, but we have Cyprien. He makes comedic skits and also longer short films. He also has a great podcast with loads of star guests. Then we have Squeezy. He makes videos on loads of different topics. Sometimes he does subreddit videos and sometimes he makes longer videos like Hide and Seek and Who's the Imposter with loads of different guests as well. He also does a lot of gaming. Next is Natu. She makes skits and storytime videos. Lucla and Caruto are comedy YouTubers who do big projects inviting loads of guests to play random games. Next we have Kulas Bim who makes animated comedy videos. He doesn't upload very often, but if you're just finding him now, you can go back and watch his older videos. Deo Tunes is another animation style comedy YouTuber. Then we have Pref. This is a sort of comedic YouTube mini series. They haven't uploaded a video in ages, but the ones they have uploaded are really good. Seb is another really popular YouTuber. He now makes informational videos, comedic videos, and also music. He used to make short skits, but his content now is more focused on music. Jill's content is a bit hard to define. There's Try Not To Laugh, Story Times, and Gaming. Raska makes a lot of videos relating to rap with games and different guests. Teo Babak makes short comedic skits with a very random sense of humour. Mr V also makes skits, but his content revolves a bit more around music and rap. He doesn't post very often, but you can see him on other channels. Freddy Gadieu also makes comedic skits and react videos and vlogs. He also doesn't post very often, but is very active on other channels and Instagram. Aurélien Preveux does a lot of skits and videos where he plays games with his friends. Fabien Olicard is a mentalist who makes content surrounding puzzles and deductions. Sofian makes videos about different shows and movies. The following YouTubers make fairly similar content, though they all put their own spin on it. Basically a large variety of different concepts. From trying out life hacks and buying strange items off the internet, to vlogs and more elaborate challenges, and just reacting to content on the internet. Each of these channels does a varying amount of each of these things, 
but I couldn't come up with a unique enough things to say about each of them, so I invite you to just check out the ones that catch your eye. The links will be in the comments. This Joika. Mastu. Amixem. Théodore. Snap Trucks. Neoxy. Inox Tag. The next category is educational or informational channels. First we have Dr. Nozman, who makes videos about unusual sciencey things, a bit like Vsauce. Hugo Decrypt makes videos about current events, sort of like a more casual, more internet-based news outlet. His second channel has interesting interviews with influential figures. Les bons profs make videos to help French or French-speaking high school students with a variety of school subjects such as physics, psychology and history. Bright Future makes videos about school in France and productivity. This is aimed towards French high schoolers because it focuses on the exam system and university choices and things like that, but she also has vlogs and more general videos on internships and part-time jobs. Next is Dirty Biology, who makes videos about different biological topics. Nota Ben makes videos about history and different historical events. Next is Stock7, who makes list videos and pretty much anything. His videos always have seven things or some variation of seven. Liv is a YouTuber who makes videos on true crime events. Her videos are really well made and interesting. Sonia Lu also makes true crime videos, but hers are generally a bit longer. Horia is another true crime YouTuber. Filled Up makes videos about different mysteries and horror stories on YouTube and on the internet in general. 100% Doc is a channel that makes documentaries about a variety of topics relating to society. 36.9 makes documentaries about different health issues, and this one is Swiss, so you'll get to see different accents and vocabulary. Le Fait Papillon is another channel that makes documentary videos. Passant Fécond makes informational videos about a range of different historical or scientific topics. Dave Shake makes animated videos about history and geography. Ville Préquin makes entertaining videos about different types of cars. Sir Gibsy talks about different French YouTubers, their careers and drama. Next I'm going to talk about gaming. Personally I don't watch a wide variety of gamers, so be sure to leave suggestions in the comments. So like I said before, Squeezy makes gaming videos and has a gaming channel. Farhad also makes gaming videos. He's played a lot of games that other English speaking YouTubers have played. Joueur de Crenier plays a bunch of different games and also analyzes and reviews them. One Kill Studios is a duo who play a variety of games together. The next category is streamers, which I admit is a strange category because most of these people don't even stream on YouTube, but a lot of them have become really popular from posting clips from their streams onto their YouTube channels. I personally prefer watching those rather than actual live streams because in a foreign language it's good to be able to re-watch the content. But their Twitch streams are also quite entertaining, so feel free to check them out there. Amin has really blown up recently. He makes a variety of really entertaining videos that are quite game show-like at times. He makes videos with his friend Billy, who also has a YouTube channel, though he doesn't post as much. There's Gotaga and Dragbi, who make gaming videos, and also upload edited VODs of their streams, where they invite different guests on and play mini-games, which is really entertaining. Most of the streamers do a combination of playing games and reacting to shows and videos. They also occasionally make more structured, long-form content. Some examples are Lanka, Action, Locklear, Magla, and Henri Tr. 
gaan. Next I have journaling slash art slash study YouTubers. It's Choco Dessine who makes art videos, basically how to draw and stuff like that. There's Catherine and De Jolie Shoes, who both make productivity, planning and bullet journaling videos. Lily Network also makes planning and study videos. The final category is lifestyle slash vlogs. I don't really watch that many vlogs, so I don't have that many recommendations. One tip I have for finding different YouTubers is to find a genre that you like and search up in your target language or use one of the channels that I mentioned and just watch one video and then go into the recommendations on the side and see if there's anything that interests you. We have Marianne Oulala who makes videos about her life in different parts of East Asia. Louisan makes videos about Japan and Japanese culture. Lena Situation makes vlogs and story times. Misu is a university student who makes really calming vlogs where she studies and talks about her day. Luan is also a university student who makes vlogs where she travels and hangs out with friends. Lilia Rosa vlogs her life in a really friendly way. She has subtitles in English on some of her vlogs and also sometimes vlogs in English with French subtitles, which may be a good way for you to practice your reading comprehension. A lot of the other YouTubers on this list also make vlogs along with their other content. So if any of these channels catch your eye, please be sure to go over to them, check them out and subscribe if you like their content. Again, all the links will be in the comments. Please leave a like and subscribe if this video was helpful to you. Don't hesitate to add any of your favourite French speaking channels in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.